and welcome everybody to the Energy Center. This is the south side of the Energy Center, uh, south side, east side. Um, Highway 28 is just on the other side. And that is, uh, on the left hand side there, that is uh, the field house inside and a walking track above it. And then over here, as you pan over, there are two skating rinks in there. Uh, there's more stuff than that, but there's primarily that's what is right there. At the parking lot, you can see the city workers. Looks like they're doing some sort of driver training. I hear them talking about backing them in and this and that. And in the distance is a football field. And over here, which you've seen in other video, I'll just show you quickly as I pan around, but that's the soccer fields. And we'll take a walk into the Energy Center. All right, so here we have the Thomas Voorhees, I hope I said that right, Memorial Field. This is basically a football field. So this is the east side of the Energy Center as you come in. And if you look off in the distance behind that tractor there, you kind of see a white roof and you'll see the cars there. That's Highway 28. So that's where you would come in uh, to access it, you can access it from here. Road from the north, uh, I think that's 16th Avenue. And again, on the other side of the soccer fields over there, uh, sort of where I started, uh, where, the way I came in from the south. So we'll take a quick walk here. The gates are closed for obvious reasons. This town is rampant with uh, thefts and graffiti and this plain old stupidity but it is what it is so you can kind of get a look at the field there and nice and scoreboards on I'm not sure that's the time so I guess it's just kind of preset to that all the time but yeah I'll see if I can get a uh, drone shot and maybe get a little bit of a little bit of a shot I don't want to do too much because if it goes over the fence then I'm screwed but that's that. I just come around to the north side and there's a big fence to open. A city worker just coming out. And he said they're doing some work in the field and I asked him if I could come in and take some shots for my channel. And he said, oh, by all means. So I'm coming up on the, the berm hill you kind of see all the way around the field. Standing on top of it. Again, the energy center. You can kind of see the highway there in the distance. take a nice shot of the field here and I'll go out in the field and take some drone shots and you can kind of see so just on the other side of those trees probably I'd say a kilometer would be where the uh, be where the uh, kind of cold lake north sort of housing boundary starts so just do a quick another 360 here and We'll do some shots of the, the field. All right, so I'm up here in the stands now. And the, the city worker came back to me and he just was concerned about the drone laws. I imagine he uh, talked to somebody and I said, nope, don't want to cause any problems. So I said, I don't need to fly the drone. I can get some good pictures from just standing up here. So that's what I'll do. Just take some shots of this. Yeah, so you can see all the stands there. And again, soccer fields in the distance. And the football field. AstroTurf, I didn't realize that. Makes sense. More cost effective, less time in maintenance, but you know, it's a, it's a nice looking field. A nice looking building. I know this is a relatively new building. So I'm not sure what's in here. I've never been in here. I don't know if there's, a, I would imagine seating for maybe rainy or crappy days, but it might be a restaurant or something in there. Not really sure. So that's about it for that. So here's the south side. And there's the city bus. We have buses that go from north to south. Many stops, including the base, transfer point at the mall. 
and the best thing about it, it's free. Here's the parking lot. There is Highway 28. Kind of look around over there. You'll see the community gardens in that fenced area. And uh, school kids up there, I think, playing ball. And I'm just going to walk over here and show you the soccer field. This, as you can see, is called the Mach 1 Skate Park. A list of all the rules. And here's the park. We spent quite a bit of cash on this, but it gets well used. And it is a nice, a nice park. Is a, I'll walk up here to the higher parts. And looking back, the south end of the Energy Center, that's uh, Port Arch College there, as I mentioned before. And the parking lot. Swing back around, we'll go back up. I'll go up here a bit higher and you can kind of see the runs there. I don't know what they're all called. You can see they have the bowls there and the rails for the stairs. You can go down. I think that uh, 13 in that painting, being that we're near an Air Force base, is like the runway of an aircraft carrier. That's what it reminds me of anyway. Oh, I'll go for a walk up here higher so you can sort of look down on it. Get up on the edge here and you can kind of see. Here's the back parking lot that I was at earlier. Again, a bit of graffiti there, but all in all, it's pretty well kept. A little bit better shot of the parking lot there. And again, Highway 28, looking off towards the base.